Hello, my name is Tina Addison and I'm all about good food. I have lived in Norfolk, I'm sort of a newcomer. I've only been here for 26 years and have enjoyed being a member of this community during that time. Uh, I would like to share with you a wonderful experience. It's, uh, I had a one woman art show and book signing at the Grange on January 5th and 6th. And this is a project I've been working on for about two and a half years. I actually, it all started when I wanted to write a cookbook. I found my grandmother's and my mother's old recipes and began to write them into the computer and started writing a little bit of stories about them. And uh, through this process, I found it very therapeutic to write uh, this down and expanded it to other friends and family members. So through the years, I've been collecting articles of uh, cookbooks and uh, recipes and put them together in this cookbook called Good Food for Everyone. So once I started writing, I then wanted to start taking art lessons, and I started that probably about eight years ago, thinking someday I would do a cookbook. And I started with watercolors at our local Old Town Hall, when, where the Recreation Department had uh, watercolor classes there. And I had the opportunity to be able to um, take classes there and sort of move on to other places and took classes at Rhode Island School of Design and sort of furthered my experience. I'm actually a nurse by trade, but an artist and a gardener by love. So here I have a cookbook that I wanted to put together. And then another love of my life, which is helping people eat healthy. And I always wanted to be able to focus and do my work with food pantries. So my thing is about bringing healthy, non-processed foods to food pantries. People who are in a fis uh, fiscal crisis that can't afford to buy a lot of fresh produce, I wanted somehow to figure out how to get it there. So I started uh, the Norfolk Community Garden Volunteer. And uh, this started at Gump's Farm two years ago. And uh, we were able to produce about 2,000 pounds of produce for our local food pantry. And since I couldn't do it there this year, they did construction at Gump's, I went to Plan B. And uh, this, this past growing season, I worked inside MCI Correctional Institute in Norfolk uh, with prisoners and uh, they helped to grow food for our local food pantry. So every Saturday, we have been able to, for two years now, have a free farmer's market for our local me members in crisis and in need. So here I have a cookbook. Here I have a love of gardening. Here I have a love of art. So I finally put it all together, and it's through my book. And the book, Good Food for Everyone, uh, actually the profits of this go to Food Pantry. And at the art show that I had today, I have a lot of my artwork that is in the book and artwork I've been doing through the years. And I make reproductions of a lot of them into cards. And those cards, also the profits go to Food Pantry. And I will be donating the proceeds from Saturday and Sunday's art exhibit to Norfolk, Franklin, and Millis Food Pantries. And um, it has been just a, a culmination of two and a half years of really thinking about and putting all of this together. And I want to thank everyone from Norfolk and the communities adjoining us that came and celebrated this experience with me. It was just a heartwarming experience. I had it here at the Grange. We just finished a five-year restoration and it is a magnificent building. I've always been inspired by the architecture of this building. And um, I am a Grange member. I'm actually a farmer's daughter. Grew up in Western Massachusetts, and I'm proud to say I'm a member of uh, both the Norfolk Grange 135 and the P Pomona Grange 27. And Pomona is more of a regional uh, Grange. So, I hope that anybody that's interested in contacting me will do so. Uh, you can reach me, Tina Addison, at my website. That's www.goodfoodforeveryone. That's number four, 
tinagoodfoodforeveryone.com or you can email me at tinagoodfood at yahoo.com. And thank you again for everybody that came and celebrated what I'm all about.